Hey everybody, Jason here. Welcome to my knot channel. In this video, we're gonna have a look at the handcuff knot. Okay, so let's head on over to the work table and take a look. The handcuff knot has been used in search and rescue operations and also to restrain an animal or drag an animal carcass. As an example, the two loops are placed around the wrists or ankles and the two ends are then pulled to tighten the loops for traction. Using the handcuff knot to apply tractions to limbs is potentially traumatic and must be used only when alternative lifting methods cannot be employed. In other words, the handcuff knot should be avoided because of the inherent risk of danger or damage to the victim. However, it is worth considering if there's no other way of rescuing someone. There are, of course, many other different ways to tie a loop knot, and if you'd like to discover others, I'd recommend you check out my video, 12 Great Loop Knots. I'll put a link in the description and at the end of this video. Now let's have a look at how to tie the handcuff knot. To begin, with your working rope, form two identical loops. Overlap the loops as though tying a clove hitch. Then thread each loop through the other loop and cinch up the knot. The two loops created can easily be adjusted as seen here. So there you have it, the handcuff knot. Now, as promised, here's a link to my video, 12 Great Loop Knots. I hope you check it out. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. Okay? Thanks for watching.